Would you do a, like a reboot, like a third, a third time? A, a, re a reboot? Re reboot? Yeah, a I mean, uh, God, I'm the, so, I, I love the show. Thank you. I, I, I we, love We've it. loved doing it. We shoot on this lot, yeah. and it's been great. I mean, people used to ask me years ago, would you do it again? But the word reboot didn't exist. It was like, it, uh, reboots it's were like now. a very Brady Christmas. Was it, you know, that, I mean, there, there wasn't like <laughs> the show done again. So this has been so great. And yes, we'd do it again. We'd, We'd probably have to call it the Golden Girls, but it's. Uh, <laughs> you should do the it. Golden Boys. The Golden. You could do the Golden <laughs> and use your beard. Yes, the next. You could be the another reboot. Will is definitely having <laughs> a beard because I'm getting too lazy. No, oh my God, that is a show for men to do Golden Girl, but a boy. Ver I'm just saying, I just came up with it. Use okay, it. Okay, good. Um, sure. <laughs> you're welcome. If I sell that next um, week, you can sue me. I F one word, one third. <laughs> um, that's the Nashville way. I'm just kidding. How did you celebrate the last show ending? Years ago, well, yeah. so, um, that, that, God, it's hard to remember what that was, but we all wanted to steal stuff. I mean, that's what you want to do, you know? But, but Max, this is the reason the whole reboot exists. Max Munchnik, who created the show, moved the entire set to his alma mater in Boston, uh, Emerson College, which is where it's been standing for 10 years, intact, everything on it. What? Um, and, and when they finally said, can you take your set back? That's when he said... I'm going to reboot this show, and took, he flew the set across the country. But what, the thing I wanted, there it was. It showed up again two years ago on the set. I was staring at it, and, I, and this what happened was it, our very first interview we ever did, 1998. Donnie and Marie came to visit the set. Wow! And Donnie had his questions on blue cards, and just as they were rolling, he shoved them into a box on Will's coffee table, which remained there not only for our entire eight-year run, but for the ten years that it was at Emerson College. And the set came back, was set up over here. And I turned to our producer and said, if Donny Osmond's questions are in that box, no. I'm taking it. And there they were 20 years later. Oh, yeah, isn't that funny? What? <laughs> That's kind of nuts that somebody wouldn't have stolen them. I will not stop talking until you subscribe to my YouTube channel. That's right, and I can talk a lot. Seriously, not going to stop. Yep, still here, not going anywhere. I see you. Don't walk away from this.